All right, how to get $35 worth of free gas pretty much every month using just this. Uh, it's a simple little thing. It doesn't really take that much time or trouble to do. Uh, most people know gift cards you get fuel points for. A lot of times you can get double or four times the fuel points for your gift cards. So whenever you go out to eat, go get a gift card. Go on to Cracker Barrel, go on to Applebee's, anywhere like that. Run by a Kroger real quick, grab you a gift card. Get your fuel points. Uh, if you are doing the home setting thing, or even if you own a home, you do a lot of home projects. Lowe's. Uh, buy a lot of stuff at Lowe's. Go get a Lowe's gift card. Go to Lowe's, use it, just like cash. Get your fuel points. Uh, this past year, we bought a new lawnmower. That was uh, $1,500. Got a new door for the house. That was like $1,300, $1,400. Both those times, I went and got fuel point, or gift cards. Got my fuel points, had like 3,000 fuel points those months. That's three or three dollars off, one dollar each time. So that was ninety dollars, a hundred dollars worth of free gas those months that I got it. So that's all it takes. Anytime you're gonna buy anything or spend money anywhere, go get you a gift card, get your fuel points for it. The other big thing is, too, that a lot of people don't realize is, you know, they'll go up there and they will take two vehicles or something like that. Well, if you're going to use a dollar off, get all 35 gallons of gas. 35 gallons of gas is $35 of free gas. That's, what, tank of gas, two tanks of gas, depending on your vehicle. That's why it's important to use your, take your fuel cans up there. What I do is once a month, I'll take the truck or the Jeep up there with a bunch of fuel cans. Fill up the vehicle. Fill up all my fuel cans, bring them home, use that fuel fuel throughout the month in my vehicle. Do the same thing each month. When I do have extra gas, it goes into the long term storage gas, which is never a bad thing to have. So when gas does shoot up to three dollars a gallon again for a month or two months, or like right now it jumped up fifty cents because of the holidays. When that happens, use your fuel storage gas. That cost you a dollar, dollar ten. You know, I've gotten it down to, uh, I think the cheapest I've gotten it was a quarter of a gallon with a gallon, dollar off. Sometimes they run specials where they go up to two dollars off. They do that even better. So just keep in mind the simple trick to using your code card and getting at least thirty-five dollars for the few free gas as much because it ain't nothing to get a thousand fuel points when you're buying gift cards for everything. Like I said, anytime you spend money anywhere. Go and see if Kroger has a fuel, you know, a gift card for it. Don't forget to use it every time. That's simple. Uh, if you got any other good ideas on how to get extra fuel points, uh, I know the pharmacy, things like that. I mean, if it's going to cost you the same, why not use it? Oh, the other real big one, Amazon. We always buy stuff off of Amazon. I'm always getting Amazon gift cards and getting those fuel points. So, there you go. How to get $35 worth of gas pretty much every single month for free. Uh, like I said, make sure you use all $35 or 35 gallons when you fill up. Everything you buy that you can get a, use a gift card for, you use a gift card for. Y'all have a good one. Uh, Happy New Year's. Yeah. Bye.